surgery that you would perform when a kid has biliatresia is called a what? It's called a portoenterostomy or a hepatico jejunostomy. What, what we mean what by that? Okay. What we mean by that is that we take the intestine right just as it comes out into the abdominal cavity, and we cut it. We then take the bottom piece, that distal piece we just cut, and we put it up into the liver bed. Now, what does that do? It acts as an opening when we have scored the base of the liver, like we said before. We allow the drippings of the bile to come out. Because remember, what's scarred is the is the conduit, the highway coming out of the of the liver. What we're doing is we're cutting it right at its base, so cutting into the liver itself. Because the problem is not in the liver, it's outside the liver. So you have all these little tubes coming through the liver that are trying to deliver the bile. The problem is that there is no main duct. So by cutting that out, all these, things, all these tubes weep from the surface of that cut liver. If you put a loop of intestine up there and sew it in, the drippings will then go into the intestine and be able to go into the GI tract. And then a little further down, you reconnect the GI tract so it's in continuity. And the critical point is you try to make the diagnosis earlier, not later. Is that correct? Exactly, because that will help improve your chances of having good bile flow because you don't want to wait too long. If you wait too long, then there will be irreversible damage within the liver that will not be able to help you.